Well, we won't be able to top this gentleman, I wouldn't have thought. Do you look at this? This is a cracker, Reg. Yeah, you couldn't fault this fight. But action, powerful punches, the whole thing. Bravery particularly too. What courage these kids have got. I would say at this stage, Reg, psychologically, the battle swings slightly in Swain's favour. Because he has the more experience. He's been here before. A couple of signs now and again that Brody just didn't realise the fight game was as hard as this. Swain knows how hard it is because he's been here before. Brody's just finding out. So we need to see how the young kid copes with it. Certainly not been founding, found wanting so far. Well, so you've got it level, Jim, on the unofficial card there. Well, it's, it's actually, as I said earlier, it's like a seesaw ring. Brody has a good round, Swain comes back out, makes sure he has a big round next time up. I would say now, Brody is the one who really has to dig deep and find something here. Because Swain looking confident, looking quite comfortable in there. And just as I'm saying, Brody's doing that, trying to get himself forward again. Boy, caught him on the just turned his back for a second there, Brody. Just a little sign of inexperience again. But really, Brody has to find a way to get moving forward. Doesn't move his head away at all. He's, he's accepting those punches. He's really shipping some punishment in the head in this way. This is unbelievable, Reg. Body oh, shots again. Dear, oh dear. Crowd are going crazy at the back of the hall, as you, as you would expect. But his recovery, the Welshman, is incredible, really. I mean, he always gives the impression he might start going down on his knees, and he comes back and fires again. Reg, we've got loads of world champions tonight. I wish we had a couple of British champions and can give it both of these guys because they both deserve it. This is wonderful stuff. See, the, the way Brody is moving forward to charging with his head, that's a sign of tiredness. That's not a malicious but It's just that he's losing his way a little bit and stumbling forward. But look at the way he's coming back again. Swain missing a little bit yeah, now, breathing heavily again. I still think he's tiring of the two, Jim. I think it's Swain, it looks as though he's getting tired. He, he's, he's punching himself out at times as well. He throws everything. But he knows how just to force himself on that little bit of experience because he's done it before. I mean, as I say, Brody must be saying, boy, they might have told me this game was as hard as this. Yeah, he's, he certainly found out the hard way. This what? is a tough round, oh, this one, yeah. Reg. This is a tough one to score. It is, absolutely. And Brody started so well, but Swain coming back. Just for me, with body movements, Brody's just looking that little bit more fatigued than Swain. I don't know if he'll dig deep and recover from this, but he is, his movements just look that little bit lethargic, yeah. a little bit tired looking. Yeah, See, I, then Swain was, finishes. Yeah. I was saying Swain before, Jim. I, Such I, a tight I, round. Yeah, I know. I could score it even, Reg, but I'm inclined to go with Swain. He finished the round well. But it's such a tough round. That, that's the type of round that could decide the championship. I'll just sway slightly with Swain. What a tough round that was. Well, it's... I mean, can you imagine those punches there? I mean, these fellas punching those in, and the buttons have got to be on their toes to catch up with them, brother. Look at it. So, um, punches are landed, but there you go. It's... it's uh, the body punches is, is, is the impressive bit with the Brody there, but there you are. The referee, no judges, remember, for a British Championship fight. Half point scoring mostly. Here's some of the body punches in replay. That is just at the stage oh, when you're is, saying right, Brody's winning this round. round. Now that looks as though he was going to go over there. That's a wonderful he? punching. That's when Brody yeah. got his body weight moving forward. But Swain come back. In the second half of the round, Swain come back and just didn't stop throwing shots. And that's when once again Brody started to look just a little bit tired. She's just not quite known how to cope with these attacks. Round 10 of this uh, championship 12 rounder. Vacant British Super Bantams at 8 stone 10. And uh, well, Jim Watt and I have it really on a knife edge this one. And uh, experienced referee like Roy Francis it looks like he may have to go to the scorecards. You never know this. Anything can happen and probably will in this fight. Everything else has. Incredible performance by a young man and Brody has never been past the sixth round really. I think the problem for Brody, the only problem so far, is that he's never actually managed to hurt Swain. 
with his punches. He's landed lovely body shots, which certainly sapped a bit of strength. But his head shots have never really stopped him in his tracks. Swain, so tough and so brave, just keeps coming. But once again, Brody getting himself forward. He's always prided on durability, actually, uh, Swain. Remember that time when he stopped uh, Ricky Went and retired against him? Oh, dear, there he's going. Oh, what a dramatic fall. Wonderful shot. We could have shouted out Timber there, and they dived in the ring right away. The referee stopped it, and the doctor is the first man in the ring there. It was almost like a Hollywood film there, Jim, wasn't it? The, as though he slayed away and went, oh, they're going crazy in the ring now. I hope we can still keep in touch. I wish they wouldn't do this while the other boxer was on the, on the canvas being attended. We really don't need that. Well, Reg, I was just saying, the only thing Brody hadn't managed to do was hurt Swain with a head shot, and he landed a perfect right-hand punch, bang on the chin, and the fight was all over. The referee didn't even count. And that, is, Reg, is the quality of a champion. Just when things seemed that they may be starting to go against young Brody, dug in, and he, he pulls out a punch like that. Wonderful performance, wonderful finish. Well, Billy Greve, the trainer, is saying to Michael Brody, don't let's uh, be too jubilant at this stage. Let's wait while the, the paramedics in the ring as well with the doctor. And Jim, what Lair, a dramatic as, finish this is. Just as I'm saying, he hadn't trouble with a head shot. He Bingo. caught Swain coming bang on with a perfect shot right on the button. And you can see the way his legs are here. Referee Francis knew there was no point counting there. Just hopefully they still have Swain on the floor at the moment, but I think that's just a precautionary measure. I don't think there's any great problem. They see Cotton coming forward. The best right-hand punch of the shot uh, of the fight. Bang on, and look at the way he finished the job. Wonderful performance, and I think the most relieved man in the place must be Roy Francis, because he couldn't have been looking forward to scoring this one. What a tough fight to score.